Well, there are two main reasons why teams come to Plastic. First is because they want to change the, the way they work today. Like maybe they need to implement DevOps or work faster or go distributed because now they have remote team members. And second is normally because they have a big problem with their current system that they need to solve today. Well, surprisingly, it has a lot to do with features that we normally take for granted. I mean, some teams come because they, they, they need to create branches and it takes two minutes for them in their current system because they have a lot of files. And then they come to Plastic and they love it because creating a branch is super fast. And that's simply because we don't copy, copy data or anything. It's just a simple thing for us. And then it also comes the, the entire merge process. Like, you know, merge is something that I've been there for the last 30 years or so. So it's not something new, anything new or, or special, but many systems don't do it in a, in a correct way. And that's something where we really focus and we have the, the entire merge tools and the merge engine and so on. So unfortunately, it's not like there are like super big poster features for, for most of them. It's just that the basics are, are done correctly. Yeah, then you have the big files and super big repos. Like, you know, there's teams out there using Git for the code and then using something like Dropbox or, or something else for, for the binaries, especially in the gaming industry. And we think that's insane. I mean, in Plastic, you can put everything together. You can have repositories of four, five, even more terabytes. That's not a, that's not a big deal, right? That's something we can do super easily. And then it also comes the, the thing of working distributed plus centralized, like putting that two together. That's also like a, a big important thing. I mean, for, for the big files, even our cloud repository can handle those super huge sizes and, and that's not a big problem. And then you also have the, the distributed and centralized, like teams that want to work in branches while other team members want to work centralized. We can do all together with no problem. Well, it's basically all about the structuring the work in a, in a better way, right? Plastic is just a version control, but it really helps you implement a lot of improvements in the way you work. It's like a splitting the work in smaller chunks, moving them fast forward. It's, it's actually the, the foundation for, for the bobs, right? So many teams just trying to implement the bobs find it super useful because it's like, well, it, it simply matches the way we, we want to work in the future or what, what we want to achieve with our transition to, to the bobs. Yes, it's only a version control, but at the end of the day, it boosts collaboration because the way in which you actually handle the branches and the tasks and all that, it actually defines the way in which the team works. And finally, when you move tasks forward faster, when you really go to production on a faster way, that's basically what DevOps and all modern techniques are all about, right?